how do you feel that you grew this year just as a player? Yeah, I think I just continued my development every day, uh, every week and every month kind of. Um, I felt like I just got better and better as, as the season progressed and, and I kind of just took that and, and ran with it. Thunderbirds obviously going to lose a lot of talent, you know, the older guys turning pro. What kind of role do you want to take on next year with the team? Yeah, I think, uh, you know, I'll be relied upon heavily uh, in all situations of the game. I think, you know, I'm ready for that and just my style of game will, will suit that very well and I, I, you know, I can't wait to take on that role. For, for those who aren't quite as familiar, just how would you sum up your game, the strengths and, and even the things that you may want to work on? Yeah, I, I think uh, I'm a reliable 200 foot uh, power forward. Um, you know, I think I can play really well in all areas of the ice. Um, and then as I get, you know, stronger here and add on some more weight, I think I'd like to improve my physicality, um, you know, open up some more room for myself and my teammates. What's the best, say, uh, your, your shot arsenal? What, 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 where do you score from? What, what, what are the elements in your shot arsenal that do you feel are, are, are the strongest? Yeah, I think, you know, it's improved a lot actually the course of the season. Um, I worked on it a lot last summer and I'm going to continue to work on it. But, I, you know, I think I scored in a variety of different ways this year, uh, you know, around the net, but also for range. So I think I can, you know, be dangerous from, you know, anywhere in the offensive zone. What are you looking forward to the most about getting to head eventually to a place like Anaheim? Yeah, I'm super excited, obviously. Um, you know, I've never been to California in my life, so i uh, excited to get down there and, and see what it's like. But I can't wait to join, you know, this young, you know, exciting uh, core that they have going on here. Who are the, some of the guys that you're looking forward to playing with? Uh, yeah, I'm just excited to meet, you know, like Zegris, McTavish, all those young guys that, you know, I'm starting to look up to uh, and that have made a really big impact in the NHL and a huge impact on this Docs organization. Who are some of the, the Thunderbirds veterans that really helped you out along the way? Yeah, I think uh, a guy like Reed Schaefer this year um, kind of went through what I did last year. Uh, he was huge for me, um, you know, throughout the course of my draft year, uh, being there and able to talk to him throughout, you know, the whole season, like I said. And, and yeah, it's, it's, you know, I can't be thankful enough for him. You've been a part of some pretty special Seattle Thunderbirds teams. How has playing in the Western Hockey League with those groups helped your development? It's been huge. Um, yeah, like like you said, the, the Thunderbirds over the past two years that I've been, a, you know, with uh, with them has been unbelievable for my development. Uh, playing with those, you know, elite talent every single day has just helped me progress throughout the past two years, and I, you know, I'm super thankful for it. How tight was that team? Uh, it was it was ultra tight. Um, you know, it was the tightest team I've ever played for. Everyone was, you know, every time we strapped on and, and put that jersey over our head, um, you know, we're battling for one another, and it ended up paying off.